eight thirty now, and it is time for our high beam this morning. Always happy to welcome in Holly Flickinger from Hospice Browse and Buy, manager there. And how are you this morning? Good, good. It's getting warmer, little it by is. little. It is, and the flowers are starting to come up, and <laughs> springtime's coming, and happy days. It is. It's good times. So always glad to have you in. And this morning, uh, first of all, I guess I need to talk about what's on sale because you always do something that's uh, surprising to me. We do. We do. Um, we've got a mystery sale going on in uh, the Dover and the Carrollton. So the manager, it was a mystery manager sale. So the Dover store is having white tag, 25% off. Anything with white tags, including the collectibles, those are all 25% oh. off. And then in Carrollton, we have shoes, jewelry, and purses at 25% off. And that's through Saturday. Then next week, we're going to have through April 2nd. Isn't it amazing? April yeah, already? Yeah, I know. Next um, Friday. Purple, 50% off. And green tickets, 99 cents. So that that's good. And um, I'll talk a little bit about our Yerkesville store that will be closing on Friday, April 1st. Okay. Um, the sale starts tomorrow. We're going to have 99 cents and under. Everything that's for sale in this store. So Wow. And we're opened um, Tuesday through Saturday, 10 to 4. Okay. And uh, again, that's going to be closing on April 1st. Yes. This was not this was not your idea. Let's make that clear. You, correct. <laughs> <laughs> there, there is a board of directors, and, uh, and this was pondered for quite a while, I assume. Yes, it didn't come overnight. Uh, you know, we had been looking at that on the sales and what was going on, and, and we just didn't make enough to support so, you know, we do have our Dover location and our Carrollton location. So we're still able to help patient care. And that's the idea. We want to make the money for the patient care for people that can't afford their, their res- you know, they've depleted all their resources right. for payment. And we certainly, everybody's invited to shop there. I know people from here, it's a short drive to Dover, a little longer to Carrollton, not, not too far. But there are different things at each store, obviously, by the way this operates. You don't know what you're going to find in a particular week, right? Correct. And we've got people that'll come in and say, and in, even including my husband, and when do you think you're going to get that in? <laughs> what? <laughs> it's like, we got to get it donated first. <laughs> we don't order things. We wait for donations. <laughs> Either and, that or I pray. <laughs> well, that, that, I pray for the night before and hopefully it'll come in. I, that could help. Uh, we're not accepting donations at your Is that right? We are no longer accepting there, but we are accepting them in our Dover location and our Carrollton location. Now, our Dover location, our drop-offs are uh, Monday through Friday. They, they're from 9 to 4.30. And on Saturday, they're 9 to 2.30. Okay. And then in our Carrollton store, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, 10 to 3. So you don't have to call ahead. You know those times are, are Correct. coming up. But we still would like to have a weight limit on any particular item? Uh, well, 25 pounds in the bags of clothing. Okay. Um, you know, it's hard to maneuver those around. Uh, like yesterday I had, for instance, in the Eurexville store, I had trash to bring out. Yeah. I couldn't get it into the dumpster. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> so I couldn't lift the lid to put it in. So a customer came in and he helped Kay get, get this, uh, roller skates. And, and I thought, oh, he's the prime because he came right in and helped her. Mm-hmm. I was like, oh, would you like to help me? If I open the lid up, will you throw that in? And, and he did. And I, I thanked him and, you know, I thank that, that people will yes. do that. Yeah. But, and. And also, bags could rip, and we don't want clothes all over the floor or outside or anything like that either. Or, yeah, dropped off on hours that were not open. Oh, yeah. Um, you know, they'll get rained on, or sometimes people go through them and will come there, and they're just strewed all over the parking lots. <laughs> yeah. Now, the volunteers um, we still could use those, I'm sure, in Dover and Carrollton. Oh, always. We could always use, you know, they can stop in and get an application. It's just a short application. Uh, and we'll work around whatever they want to work. If they only want to work two hours a week, that that's fine. We'll we'll take them two hours a week, or you know, once a month. It's just whatever they're able to give us, we would appreciate it. Well, we, I again certainly appreciate everybody who's patronized the store in Eriksville and volunteered there, and and for your work there too. Yes, but this this work continues on, like you said. The uh, the hospice still needs. Your support at the uh, Carrollton and the Dover locations. Yep, for our patient care and the other things that we've got going on for patients. That's true. And this is a nonprofit. Uh, correct. We are a nonprofit. You know, all of our resources, you know, any of our profit goes right back into for the, the patient care. All right. So how can we check? Because I'm terrible about forgetting uh, what sale is on what week. So can we go to 
Facebook, the, right? Correct. They can go on to Facebook and then they can like our page. And then, then in turn, that will give you everything that's going on. They post it weekly. Mm-hmm. Or if we have any additional sales that are going on or just pictures of things we've got for sale or things going on in our store. That's helpful. It I, is. Like it a is. book. I like a book with some pictures so I can visualize. Right. And you can zoom in. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's becoming more and more helpful too, yeah. Uh, yes. Uh, I hate to say that, but yes. <laughs> As we know. All right. Well, appreciate it. Anything else we should know before we move on to uh, April? Nope. Just thank the community for supporting the Yorksville store. We we truly repre- you know appreciate that. Yeah, yeah, very true. All right. Well, we'll have you come in and uh, keep... Uh, Keep us surprised of what's happening at the other stores and with hospice, okay? Of course. All of right. course. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Holly Flickinger of Hospice Browsing by our guest this morning on the 830 High Beam.